Southeast Queensland is struggling through the biggest mould infestation experts have ever seen. The prolonged outbreak is not only unsightly and difficult to remove, doctors say it also poses a major health risk. Angie Talleran's fight against mould has been relentless. Especially in the last week, every wall, surface, the ceiling, it's just getting blacker and blacker. For weeks, she's been scrubbing every surface of her Kelvin Grove home to no avail. I grew up here and I've never seen mould like this. Nor have the experts. Increased rain and humidity over recent months providing the perfect breeding conditions for Brisbane's biggest outbreak. From really large homes to um, office buildings to cars, you name it, we're starting to see mould grow everywhere. It's not just unsightly, it's also harmful. The major effects are inhaling that the mould spores and cause them rhinitis, runny nose, you know, hay fever and trigger asthma. Experts recommend trying to get rid of mould yourself first. Use a disposable cloth and domestic cleaner, vinegar or olive clove oil and always wear PPE. We recommend drying your house with a dehumidifier or putting your air conditioner on dry cycle. While dehumidifiers are one of the most effective ways to dry out damp homes, they're in short supply. Retailers across the southeast are sold out. I've got a lot on order. The demand is huge. Um, it's just waiting game. This is beyond me. And it's set to continue with a wet winter ahead. Samantha Heathwood, 7 News.